Happy Monday. Today is the 12th. I'm Dylan Giovanni with Behind the Markets. One of the, we got a lot of notes this weekend, folks asking about Eli Lilly. And, you know, the stock was up big last week after they reported killer second quarter earnings. The company did $11.3 billion in revenue, which is up 36%, which is just huge. It's unbelievable. And even more surprising, Wall Street was expecting $9.9 billion in revenue. The stock was up over 100 points. So, you know, I mean, it's just been a great run. One of the couple of things that I wanted to point out, a lot of folks have been asking whether it's time to sell this thing. And that's a fair question. I mean, we recommended it at $430. But, you know, I still like it here at 845. I, I'm telling you, because I, I listened to the earnings call and two things struck me about this call. The first was something the CEO said. He said, we see, I'm quoting here, I wrote it down. We see unbelievable demand. And we're not even trying that hard to promote this drug. He's talking about Zepbound, of course, their weight loss drug, which is just revolutionizing not only Eli Lilly's business, not only the way we treat weight loss, but it's going to revolutionize the way we treat a host of other diseases. The other thing that struck me about this earnings call was that he said that ZepBound is now available on 86% of the commercial insurance coverage lists now. So what we're seeing here from the time we recommended it last year and about a year and a half ago, basically March of last year-ish, what we're seeing is drug gets approved and it start, people start rushing in to pay for it. They're paying basically retail for the drug. And it just starts to get more widely adopted as it goes on. And now even insurance, it's such a powerful drug that even these insurance companies are saying, we can't even not cover this drug, which is kind of what we talked about when we first recommended it. I just didn't understand how this drug wouldn't get covered. And you know, maybe I have extra insight because I was the fat kid growing up. I was like, this is gonna be big. But you know, I, and I've talked about this before and I wanted to answer questions. We got like three of them this weekend. So I thought it was important to record this first thing Monday morning. And by the way, I also want to invite you in to ask any questions, email customer support if you're a customer of ours and you know, ask any questions you have and I'll answer them on these videos. I'm happy to do that, really. So the weight loss story is starting, you know, we are in the third inning of the weight loss story. There is still a lot more room, and I've talked to you about this in the past. What I've said is that I'm looking for other companies that we can actually move into. I still like Eli Lilly. I still like Novo Nordisk. We've taken profits on small trades around these companies. We took 300% profits with Viking, 200% profits with Altimune. We've traded in and out of those particular stocks, and I'm looking for ways to get back in to those particular stocks, which we're working on a new report now, into smaller trades around Eli Lilly and Novo Nordisk, because we made a great profits on both. We're up, you know, basically almost 100% on uh, Eli Lilly and Novo Nordisk, now the question is, as I've been talking about, our research team is, and I'm spending a lot of time thinking about how to trade around this weight loss revolution. And, uh, you know, there are going to be some great opportunities that we're going to be talking to you about in the coming days and weeks. So I hope you have a great start to your week. Remember, if you have any questions, just email customer support. I don't want to say our support email address in public because we have some people who watch these videos that are not customers. This is for customers only. Have a wonderful week.